Well, the prospect of irreversible climate change really is frightening for people, but people really don't know what to do about it. And what we've worked through the Prince's Rainforest Project is a really practical and simple way that people can make a difference. And I think that's fantastic. But McDonald's was instrumental in setting up the current Amazon soy moratorium. And therefore, by influencing our supply chain, we can really encourage responsible sourcing. We have a global beef policy where there will be no beef sourced from any recently deforested area, i.e. areas that have been deforested in the last two years. I think when major businesses make that sort of commitment and set those sort of standards, that really can make a difference to these areas. Of course, the business community has an important role, as do individuals, as do governments. It really has to be a collaborative effort right the way through uh, society. And I think some of those businesses that have a more direct impact on those rainforest re areas do have a greater responsibility and should live up to that and take action. So some of it is making big steps and raising awareness on a grand scale, which is what the Rainforest Project is all about. But also it's making small changes in the way we live our lives, because those small changes all add up and can really can make a difference. I think the greatest benefit to McDonald's is really that our staff and our customers will be so grateful that we've been able to communicate to them a way that they can make a difference. And through the Prince's Rainforest Project, there is a very simple and practical way that they can get involved in halting or, or, or slowing down at least the destruction of the rainforests and, and the damaging effect that's having on climate change. I think everyone feels helpless when they consider the, the, the impact of rainforest destruction. But when you break it down into bite-sized pieces, there is something that all of us can do in the way we live our lives and make small changes that can help halt or at least slow down rainforest deforestation. Spiders, rainforest spiders. I am terrified of spiders. So if we can preserve the rainforests, it's far more likely that the spiders will stay where they should and will be less likely to come and influence us here.